two households, both alike in dignity, in fair Verona, where we lay our scene. From ancient grudge break to new mutiny, where civil blood makes civil hands unclean. From forth the fatal loins of these two foes, a pair of star-crossed lovers take their life, whose misadventured, piteous overthrows do with their death bury their parents' strife. The fearful passage of their death-marked love and the continuance of their parents' rage, which, but their children's end, naught could remove, is now the two hours' traffic of our stage. The which of you with patient ears attend what here shall miss, our toil shall strive to end. From July 30th to August 11th this summer, I was in a production of Romeo and Juliet as part of the Oxford Shakespeare Festival. I was Juliet. For three months we'd rehearsed in a church hall on the outskirts of Oxford or in the sunny parks during the heat wave. We met almost every day in the week, using rehearsals as an excuse to hang out with each other. We all made incredible friendships. Four months down the line and we still talk in the group chat every day. Then we took to our stage at Oxford Castle for our two-week run. We performed in the courtyard of the castle, where each night we watched the sun set as we ended Act 1, only for the space to be lit up for Act 2. It was an absolute passion project, from head to toe. Every single cast and crew member so fully believed in their role that the show just felt alive, and the audience could feel that. Our director had such a clear vision for what he wanted for the show. He gave a new lease of life to one of the most famous stories of all time. He had some stupid ideas too, but we were always quick to call him out on them. And I was so fortunate to have so many people come to see the show too. It was the single most incredible, rewarding, and one of the hardest things I've ever done. <laughs> and I'm so... So grateful for it. I'd like to lift a glass or a teacup to Romeo and Juliet, William Shakespeare, and the most fantastic summer of my life. Oh my god. To Michael Spade! <laughs> and the darkness! And the rain! I will forever be so proud of what we created. For never was a story of more woe than this of Juliet and her Romeo.